Firstly, Matt, welcome to St Albans. Um, Thank you. How exciting is it to, to join the club for yourself? Yeah, yeah, it's really interesting. Um, I say I haven't worked in the female game before, um, only the male game and with uh, uh, academies and different clubs. So, yeah, for me, it was a case of getting back into coaching and spent a bit of time out of coaching. Um, so, yeah, looking forward to it. And everyone so far has been great. Brilliant. And it was a 4-2 defeat today to Royston. First defeat of the season, but fair to say it was a competitive game in midfield. I would yeah. Say. yeah. How would you sum up the, the match? Yeah, yeah, really interesting game, actually. We knew that coming in. Uh, we had an idea of how they would play, had an idea of their shape, uh, stuff that we worked on. Uh, had a session with them on Thursday, so it's the first time I had time in the players. Um, mm -hmm. So, yeah, really, really positive so far in terms of them taking on board what I'm asking them to do. In time, hopefully, we'll improve that and get better at it. Yeah. Uh, I felt the same, very, very competitive. Uh, struggled to remember clear-cut chance created by the opposition, but goals were scored from set pieces and second and third chance opportunities, which are, are, are tough to take. Uh, yeah, as you say, um, not too many chances created. Did you get Emma Slater is on, on the Royston side? She's one of the best players in the league. Did you have a plan in mind to maybe restrict her as well? Yes, yeah, we noticed uh, a tendency to, to want to play down her side. Uh, so we just looked at our shape and how we could uh, counteract that. And obviously we noticed that she moved across the pitch during the game as well, perhaps uh, down to how well she was being defended uh, by our players. But yes, yeah, obviously a really bright spark in their team. So it was up to us to try and uh, counteract that. And despite the result today, it's been obviously a great start to the season. Um, mm. You must be, it must be exciting to work with this group. And are you still, um, you know, confident that we could be at the upper end towards the end of the season? I think that's the aim. And I think that's, uh, when I spoke to the club, that's their ambitions as well, which is great. Obviously, it's difficult then coming into a team that have won all their games and are performing so well. Uh, and then your first game is a game like that. Um, but look, it's about building and getting better. So it's not about changing what Ant's done. It's great that Ant's staying on with us. Uh, it's about building on what he's put in place and trying to refine it, make it better and try and make us more disciplined out of possession. Yeah, and on that, just quickly, um, obviously got the girls off to a good start, although this is probably the toughest game that you've had so far, yeah. that be all that being said. Um, how has he been helpful for you to settle in? Yeah, he's, he, he's been unbelievable. He's, he's uh, answered every question that I've had uh, and answered it better than I thought he was going to answer it as well. He's got so much information on the players, background on other teams, uh, and he's been so studious, obviously, with the players. He's got a great relationship with the players as well, which is why I was really keen to keep him in the fold. Brilliant. Cool. Thanks for your time, Matt. You're welcome.